Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Rohit Tech. Today, in this video we will learn how to take backup of Active Directory, and how to restore Active Directory backup. Our computer name is, Server. Our domain name is stb.local. Our Ethernet 0 IP address is 172.16.0.1. First of all let me tell you, we have only one domain controller in the environment, whose name is stb.local. Before backing up Active Directory, I would take you to my Active Directory users and computers. And I will show you to my users and OU. Expand domain name. As you can see, there is some OU here and there is a user inside it. Let's close Active Directory users and computers. Go to Server Manager Dashboard. Now I am going to add Windows Server Backup feature in the server. Click Add Roles and Features. Click Next. Select Role Based and Feature Based Installation then click Next. Click Next. Windows Server Roles, leave as default. Click Next. Let's drop down little bit. Find out the Windows Server Backup feature. Here it is, let's click on it. Click Next. Click Restart the destination server automatically if required. Click Yes. Click Install. Installation is succeeded. Click on Close. Go to Tools. Click on Windows Server Backup. Click on Local Backup. Click on Backup once. Click Next. I want take only system state backup, so I will choose the custom option. Click Next. Click Add Items. Select System State. Click OK. Click Next. This is the remote share folder option. In this option it will asking to store the data in the network location or remote drive. I don't have a remote location right now so I'll be back from here. I will choose local drive. Click next. Backup destination is automatically selected. Click Next. Click on Backup. It takes a long time to have an AD system state backup. In this video I have speeded up this backup process to save time. Our system state backup is completed. Click on Close. Now we can go the backup location on this server. Open this PC. Open E drive. As you can see, this is our backup folder. Let's close E drive. Close Windows Server Backup Console. Now we can restore the Active Directory System State Backup. Before AD System State Restoration, I will go to Active Directory Users and Computers. Now I will delete some of my organizational units and users here for the testing purpose. I am deleting both the users inside the accounts OU.
Delete the ITOU users. Delete purchase OU users. Now I am going to delete OU. All are OU protected from accidental deletion. First of all we have to remove their protection. Click on view. Click advanced feature. Go to account OU properties. Click object. Uncheck, protect object from accidental deletion. Click apply. Click OK. In the same way, we will remove the protection of ITOU2. Now we can delete the accounts and ITOU. Now both of our OU are deleted. Uncheck the advanced feature. Like I told you earlier. That I am deleting OU and users for testing purpose. Now I am going to restore Active Directory Backup. Go to Run. Type msconfig then press Enter. Click on Boot. Click on Save Boot. Click Active Directory Repair. Click Apply. Click OK. Click Restart. As you can see, it will provide an error to log on as Domain Admin, you can log on as PC Admin. Click OK. Click Other User. Type Administrator. Type Password. Press Enter. Our server 2022 is run as Active Directory Repair Safe Mode. Go to Tools. Click on Windows Server Backup. Click on Local Backup. Click on Recover. Select this server. Click Next. Select Backup Date then click Next. Click System State. Click Next. Select Original Location. Tick and select the Perform an Authoritative Restore of Active Directory Files. Click Next. Click OK. Click on Recover, click Yes. This restoration process will serval of minutes or hour, so in this video I speed up this process for save the time. Click Restart. Log on as Local Administrator. Go to Run. Type msconfig then press Enter. Click on Boot. Uncheck the Save Mode. Click Apply. Click OK.
Click Restart. Now this time to log on as Domain Administrator. Go to Tools. Click Active Directory Users and Computers. Expand Domain Name. As you can see, those who deleted us OU are back, our accounts OU and IT OU are back, and the users who were in both these US are also back. So viewers in this video you can learn, how to take Active Directory System State Backup and how to restore Active Directory System State Backup in Windows Server 2022. Thanks for watching this video. Please like share and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for latest updates.